hello guys guess where we are today we're in uganda kampala oh my goodness we i love this place if you didn't know which of course i believe you don't i am ugandan i this is this is my home country this is where i'm born this is where i lived my entire life before i got to travel to dubai but I don't live here that much nowadays now that i started working in dubai so i only get to come here once in a year and i got to, i get to be here for only a month you know work stuff yeah so uh, like i'm here on my vacation my annual vacation and my goodness you guys we have this place has the best weather we have the best weather I did not get to appreciate this before like because this is where i used to live i never like i never traveled but when i traveled and then came in there is a very big difference like there's the way this weather even gives you healing because there's a way i'm feeling like my skin feels better and i can tell it's the weather because i'm not using anything different just my usual stuff what i normally do but it. so i'm not here to talk about the weather today but we are gonna do a house tour there's a place that i got um i tried to get a place online because uh i don't have a house of my own yet here in uganda so like every time i do come here when i'm on my vacation i usually stay with my sisters or my cousins sometimes but this time around i needed my own space i needed my own privacy like it's not like imposing because i believe they don't mind definitely they don't mind but i just wanted my own space this a certain feel i needed to get like to be away from the hustle i needed to be somewhere relaxed and ambient and beautiful and i did manage to get that space so it's what we are doing today i did get this place uh, on booking.com and i thought it's really nice but i was actually worried that maybe because sometimes photos do lie but this is a very beautiful place i'm not disappointed and um, i'm gonna show you around i hope you get to enjoy it and love it just as i am so without further ado let's get into this house too welcome to our apartment so as you come in here you immediately uh, we start with the living room and this is this is our living room i love this setup we get some empty vases we have anything that are really nice for decor which i love I love everything that is in this room because it has a very cool tone. I did not want anything wrong. I was very specific when I was looking for this apartment. When I was looking for apartments, most of the ones I saw, they were like, the furniture was too brown, like the wood. I didn't like the, the very dark brown wood. I needed something a bit dark, which this is giving me. Whoever walked on this house, I mean, the interior designer really has a good taste. Like, there's nothing I do not love about this room. Look at this. I really don't know why they got their stuff, but it's very nice. Uh, the chandeliers, I love this chandelier. Can you help me please switch on the lights? So you can see. See how beautiful the lights are from this window on this. And here, it's such a beautiful. And, uh, this right here, I think this is some kind of their lights, but there are no lights, it's not working. There is no switch. We have some frames, some nice frames. What else? This right here, I love this whole setup, as you can see. Most of the apartments I saw when I was trying to look for a place, like when you see a TV, it's nicely hung on the wall, but you could see wires that would pull through 
and he does not give up on him at all. I hate that. I love how these people did and like it's so modern. Can you come closer so that you can see it? Some golden leaf. I don't know how they did it. And then these empty vases. These are just some drawers. Whatever you might want. And this is a DVD right here. It comes with uh, DSTV. When you pay, you get everything. You have access to everything. You have Wi-Fi. And uh, this is our view right here, which I will get to later on. Let's first go on to the next room, which will be this. This is the kitchen. This is our kitchen. It's a very small kitchen, but very useful. We do have everything that we need. There are cooking utensils so you have to cook for yourself and uh, whatever you want. This is here. This sugar just it did come with the sugar. I bought it, of course. I had to buy some stuff of which yes, I haven't bought much. I'm going to do shopping. I have to go to the market market or the supermarket I'll see so I can buy stuff for cooking come let's see them and this is the fridge it's empty <laughs> we don't have much in there just have a few sodas so like I said I'm going uh, I'm going to do a little shopping I'm going to buy whatever we will need as long as I'm still here so this is the kitchen comes fully equipped with everything uh, you might need so if any of you would want to travel to uganda this might definitely be your spot it gives you everything it has a beautiful view which i'm about to show you but for now we do have a microwave as well and everything is working oh. <laughs> okay, so as you go out from the kitchen, you have a corridor that goes to uh, the bedrooms. You have two bedrooms in here. Come take a closer look at this. Look this friends. Really, these people did a great job at the, at the decor. It's beautiful. It's giving me ideas for my own house. This right here is... Uh, bathroom one of the bathrooms this is a shared bathroom everything was clean we found everything clean and the showers this is working in well this does not have hot water so it's cold and uh, yeah that's it so friends how do you guys love this setup look at this isn't this so cute really when i finally I can't wait for the day I'm going to design my own house because it's going to be spectacular. These are stones that they, uh, how do they call it? I don't know what they do, but it's beautiful. It's not a frame that you just put a mirror on here, but it's, it's so beautiful. It's so pretty. So this takes us to the next bedroom, which is this. This is what I asked for because I'm here with children. This is where they stay, which is so beautiful. So we do have these mosquito nets because there are not lot, there aren't so many mosquitoes in here, but for safety, you know. Last night I did experience some mosquitoes because we did not uh, we forgot to close the windows early so mosquitoes got to come in and it wasn't so good last night but the night before that it was all okay so this is it look at this but this is the wardrobe these girls try to organize their own stuff in here making them feel comfortable and this is the rest of it it's a very big space so if you're traveling with lots of stars you do have the picture. It's 
a very good excuse. You can put a lot of stuff in here. From the window, we do have a nice view, which I'm about to show you guys. How cool is that? I'm gonna show you that later on. Let's go on to the next room, which is the master's room. And this is the master bedroom. It's big. It's so big. This this place just makes me want to stay here forever. Which I can't unfortunately, but I love the feeling. When I was looking for a place to stay, I wanted some I wanted a place that can make me feel like I'm home. Yes. I love these lights. Beautiful chandeliers. If you can come closer. Yeah. And we have also this. There's this light here as well. How cute is that? To leave one and into the other. It's beautiful. So like I was saying, I, I was looking for, I, I could have gotten a hotel, but I didn't want to feel like I'm in a hotel. I wanted to feel like I'm home, like it's my home. I needed that feeling. I wanted to be able to cook for myself, act like I'm home in my own home, not a hotel kind of feeling. Room service now. There is a place and time for all of that, but now I just need to feel home. And this place is giving me everything that I need in a home. So yes, this is my room. This is where I stay. And I love this little setup as well. Look at this golden chair. It came with this pillow, which I believe is too big for the chair, but it's okay. So love these things. And we do have a very big wardrobe as well which I tried to organize. I did put in some of my clothes that I will wear. And uh, this, is, this is so messy, but that is that. You can see, it's so messy. And we also, the master comes with its own bathroom, but this bathroom is not the, it's, it's not big actually, the other bathroom is bigger than this. I don't know why they did that, but it's what it is. And we do have a water heater, which is good because I can't, with cold water, I cannot. So this is the, the bathroom that comes with this bedroom, which is really small. It's very small, but it gives you everything that you need, everything that you want. So, that's that. And um, so this is my view from the window, if you can see it from outside. It's so pretty, it's so beautiful. You can just, one can just stay here forever. This, the weather is so beautiful, you just have no idea. Look at this, just look at that. Isn't that so pretty? Like that's, this is just a view from the bedroom, but when you go, um, I'm gonna go outside and show you everything else. So from the living room, I forgot to show you how the see, it does come from all the way down it gives room for light and stuff so you can open this up and we do have a nice little balcony as you can see come come and see come and see this we do have a nice little balcony out here as you can see we have a very beautiful view and malcolm is down there to the camera <laughs> okay let's go down and we see the rest of the stuff oh let me out from the kitchen we do have a little door that goes outside and uh, this place by the way it does have it does come with a swimming pool 
But as of right now, they still they say they are still working on it. I don't know if it was under construction, but right now they told us that that the what they are cleaning up the water. But they told us in a few days. Today is Monday. They told us on Wednesday everything will be ready and the swimming pool can get to be used and these kids cannot wait to use it. So now as you come out and this is the pool that I was talking about. As you can see it's still it's not so good looking because they say they are cleaning it up and uh, we hope that in two because I, I think tomorrow or the next day they said it's going to be ready the kids want to use it so we hope that it can be used soon and as you go here look at that view show them the view see how beautiful it is out here it's so pretty it goes all the way these apartments are so big there's i think there are two blocks of apartments that are the same we are on one and the other one is the the one you're looking at right now it's beautiful the kids can play around here and yeah i think that's it so i think i'm gonna end the video here i don't think there's any more to show and today we had we featured malcolm what's your name what's your name malcolm. why are you shy <laughs> okay so guys thank you so much for watching i hope you enjoyed our video our little apartment tour and please don't forget to subscribe if you are new i'm going to be making new, uh, more videos for i still have a few weeks here so i'm gonna try to make sure i do more videos on here if you are new please subscribe like comment share and let me know of your thoughts down below and that would be it for today thank you guys for watching bye bye Malcolm say bye to the bye. bye